everything that you're doing, not everybody's doing it. So what motivated you? I think when I read the Gospels, Jesus is clearly uh, a peacemaker who strives for peace and encourages us to be peacemakers. It's one of the fundamental Beatitudes. The sun and the at day two of the London Arms Fair or the Defence and Security Exhibition International. It's a government sponsored uh, fair for all of the arm dealers of this country to come across and meet traders from different countries, from different parts of the world to be able to deal in the wages of death. The weapons sold here end up killing children and families throughout the world. I work with refugees in, in my city and it, virtually everyone is coming from conflicts which are fuelled by the weapons that we sell in the West. The arms fair proper starts next week but this week it's all the deliveries of the tanks, the missiles, the um, guns, the uh, handcuffs that are going to be used by repressive regimes against their people and so what we're trying to do is disrupt the delivery of these items. When we came up here to block the roundabout, uh, we had been kind of successful, but I noticed that uh, a truck had been uh, had been able to get through and was about to to break this blockade. And uh, I'm a gut person, I kind of react to my gut, and I thought, it's no point being here unless we actually stop or disrupt this action. So I, I went between a couple of police officers and uh, got down on the road as fast as I could and then was eventually carried off but it did stop them using this roundabout for the trucks and they haven't we haven't seen a single one pass by the last hour and a half. We've got several hundred, possibly a couple of thousands people here from faith communities up and down the country. Anglicans, Quakers, Baptists, Buddhists, Muslims, Jews, all here united saying this arms fair is wrong. It's already been decreed by our High Court that the trade that goes on here is fueling wars in other places and those um, weapons are being used for illegal purposes, therefore the trade is illegal. For people of faith, opposing war and all that builds a war is an essential component of our faith. Yes, there have been arrests. Yes, some people have got slightly distressed because they are really upset at what's happening with the arms trade at the moment. Um, but on the whole, uh, people are just sitting, eating together. We had a shared lunch provided by the Hare Krishnas. Uh, some of us were able to share in prayers, um, midday prayers with our uh, Muslim brothers and sisters. Uh, we've shared in Catholic worship, Anglican worship that was written by URC ministers. Um, and we've had a long time of silence in the in their friends tradition. Um, obviously there's a lot going on in the world, climate change, Brexit, whatever, but if we can't oppose 
the weapons that kill children and families throughout the world, then I'm not sure what we're doing.